Rescue mission day 37. The rescue corps, thank goodness you found me. I'm York, I'm from Kopai, and came to this planet with two of my colleagues. Is one of your colleagues a veterinarian, who goes by the name Nelly? We've been searching everywhere for her. I don't like this guy, he's imposing my style. He's got a bit of white though, we're, we're all blue. You have? I'm guessing you haven't found her yet. Nelly, Don Bergman, and I are collectors, or, or colleagues, collectors, and friends. We all share a common goal, which is why we came here. But then our spaceship crashed. I'm so sorry, have, how, how have you been managing since then? For a while, we were making juice out of this growing nectar, gl glowing nectar, we harvested at night. It staved off starvation. Really? You must have been... You must be talking about glow sap. How'd it taste? Really, really yummy. Copites are famously fussy eaters, and I believe their taste buds are quite different from our own. You may recall when Dingo mistook it for a common beverage and drank some. That was a rough night. Huh? We all liked it so so much that we were practically fighting over it. So you can imagine our reaction when that thief showed up and stole our stash. We went after him right away. Of course, speed isn't really a th my thing, so I got separated from the others pretty quickly. Hmm, that's true. There's a good chance the other two aren't too far from where you split up. Unless you have a better idea as to where Nelly might be. Sorry, I've told you all I know. But Dobbs might have some more info. No. Understood. You can rest assured that the rescue is our top priority. Oh. Officers, let's narrow our search to Giant's Hearth. Ripley. Copy that. I love the different spacesuit designs. It's really cool. Now, let me go to the ID badges. We have a lot of new things here that we don't really need. But look at how many other ones we haven't got collected yet. Got a decent amount. Ah, it doesn't look like there's anything new. I, I'd hope that they, if there was something new that we could just have the icon to show. But no, that actually, it doesn't care. Okay. Anyway. I think I'm gonna have to buy some bomb rocks. Just because I don't think I can do anything else. Let's get five, just because we're gonna need a lot. So I guess because they took the the cure, they didn't actually need to they didn't they, they couldn't get leaf leafified. Treasure hunter York at your service. It's like looking into a mirror. <laughs> Almost. Thank you again for rescuing me. Okay. Is there anything else I need to be aware of? Something tells me no. So. It's pretty fine then. That it didn't show me anything. Oh, but there was something new. I mean, it's just the casual quest. Which is probably good since I spent all my materials just now, so. Good to get some more. It's nice having these quests that just give us more over time, basically. I would have thought that I would have fought a lot of things. Maybe that quest isn't available anymore. Looks like it isn't. Unfortunately. So we have to actually just be good at collecting materials and using them well. We have three pub drive. Can we get anything worthwhile? I don't think so. We can get heal, which might be good. Or some Mega Rush. I really want Mega Rush to stun enemies. Getting healthy faster is good, but also Mega Rush. <sighs> I have to. I'll, I'll hold up for now, and then we'll find out once we have some more stuff what we want to get. Have to rescue everyone and get home together.
Okay. So let's get out some reds, I think, for battle. We have so many blue Pikmin, it's actually insane. We have 420 blues. Also nice. Thank goodness we have Pikmin here. Isn't that true? Think of all the things we've done that we would wouldn't be able to do without Pikmin. I thought there was a mound of dirt there, but there was not, which is good, probably. Since we have already bought these bomb rocks. There we go. Also, I'm definitely not taking... I was thinking about taking Rock Pikmin into this fight, but I think it's probably a good idea to not do that. Since they will probably just eat my Rock Pikmin. Now let's see how well we can battle this thing. Probably not extremely well. We can try and feed it some Bomb Rocks. I don't know how well that will go for us, though. Also, that thing is so big! Oh! Oh! Good thing we increased our range. Ochi, were you just being bad? Okay. Get over here. I think we're going to try and feed it a bomb rock. Or not. Thank you. Get him! My thing ran out, that's fine. We got him. Nicely done. We'll try and get that back for the new Pikmin onion. I was like this area for it, in the middle of all this ash. Oh ho! Are we, even, are we sure this is even an onion? It's kind of rock colored. <laughs> Wow, you couldn't really make that any more obvious than you did. Good thing I have so many flowered Pikmin. I have to remember to call them off of that. So we can switch them around. They're moving so fast. And it's great. I'm excited to see just how many times we can fuse this thing. Well, let's start producing some more rock Pikmin. We can't use rock Pikmin to just get whatever needs, needs it the most now though. But that's probably fine, so. We can now propagate rock Pikmin and can build up their numbers to much higher levels and don't have to worry about extinction. I really thought that changed to red just then, in that one moment. Takes a bit to knock that down. That's okay. Good thing I left those over there as well. Unfortunately I just have to pluck these out now, but even so. It is nice having five onions fused together now. <laughs> Remember the first time we got a new onion? And I was worried because I thought it was going to overwrite the color. Also, because I, I was wondering why there was another yellow onion so early in the second area. But that was just in case we didn't go back to the first area on the next day. After being able to leave, basically. But we are fine, sir. We, w we were fine, sir. Anyway, I think that's pretty much all this area explored for the most part. There's that there, that there, and then I think it's just dungeons, which is kind of crazy, although there's that area there that we haven't gone to yet. Need to light the fire and stuff. Very nice. Let's also switch out which Pikmin are active to the recommended types. Because it's just good to have the recommended types from what I can tell. 
That's fine. Okay, so... Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> right, I need to get that. What's this? That there? How, you, this is Bomb Rocks, right? Right? Or a Bomb Rock? No, it's Materials, okay. Uh, it, it was very close to me being mad at myself. But it's fine. So where does this water pump... What is that? Oh, I need fire. I understand now why I didn't get that. We also didn't need water pigment for this. Oh, I, I don't not. You know what I mean. Blue pigment. They're fish pigment, technically, not other stuff. You know what I'm trying to say. But it's fine. Let's put that out. Just because we don't need it. It might be a good idea to move the base to over there, maybe to the middle of the map. Although, I don't know. It's probably good. We also have this here. If I can land my Pikmin on it. We should be fine. I don't think they made it back quite yet, but they're about to. So close. Not close enough though. Ah, uh, but we'll need to move the the on you know, the base so we can get some materials around quickly. Pretty much. I like that it moves the stuff at the base quickly. Also, another Dandori battle challenge. That one. Also, I probably wouldn't recommend Rock Pikmin against these spiders. Because they'll bounce off and it's not going to end well for us, probably. I think if I put these Pikmin on the, that, they won't go for that enemy. Or in front of that enemy. Hello. It's a leafling! Today we Dandori, tomorrow we Dandori more. I know they say the same thing every time, but still. Alright, newbie, time to show off your Dandori skills to that leafling. I don't know about that. We have Swallow now, though, so that's good. It's gonna be nice to be able to use Rock Pikmin more, because I don't have to worry about losing them. Because they're good at just doing damage to things if I throw them right. Just need to be careful how I use them. All together now. So I'll turn that off, which will allow us to actually use other Pikmin probably to fight that. Also, they really don't like that, apparently. There's also another thing that we need to light up, and we can make this a shortcut. If we do that, but also there's this thing. I'm not doing a great job of this fight, but that might be alright. Please, thank you. White, but almost. Okay, good. And finish it off. There we go. And they had a fruit as well. Let's go get some fire. There is some nearby, so that's good. Several spots of them nearby. Whoop. Flying around. There's also that there. Which will help us. A little bit. Oh, so that way's up as well. So that's even a... There's, there's so many paths to take. Oh! Just gonna leave that alone. I guess. 
I'm gonna get the rock pick to take back the enemy. That works. <laughs> they didn't get the all the fruit covered though, which is strange. But there we go. That's pretty decent. I think it's only that over there. So maybe we can get that back, but there's also a tunnel? Or is that no, that's just a we haven't gone there yet. We haven't gone past these traverse points. There's also a cave over there. There's a lot of stuff. Also, I somehow missed one of the Pikmin at the other base, but that's alright, because we're going to be doing other stuff anyway. In a minute here. If they have the most Pikmin on that cart, little Pikmin type, they'll take that back. Plus there's that there as well. It might be good to just grab some more of the stuff for the Rock Pikmin. Quite possibly, except I don't have it on me right now, so... Maybe once we've cleaned out the rest of these areas. Hey, snack, snack bean. Once we clear, clear out this entire area, we can just spend a day to clean up stuff. We'll probably get this stuff back for a rock pikmin or something. And ice pikmin too, because they still don't have a ton. They're doing pretty well though. Ah, uh, now. Let's pick a direction, go for it. Guess that one since it's the closest. I don't know if it's the easiest, but it's the closest. I also like the, the the music here. It's very peaceful. Treasure collected. I think that's everything taken care of. Ultimate testing range. That is not a good sign. I filled my belly with all kinds of snacks. The strongest creatures are the tastiest. Except the ultimate weapon-like one. It's barely edible. Sign Louie. So the thing about Louie is he's very, uh, food-focused, if you couldn't tell. Known as the King of the Beasts in Pikmin 2. He likes to cook them. He has a- the, the, he can go- he goes through the entire Piclopedia, or, yeah, the Piclopedia, showing, like, giving recipes for all the stuff, basically. All the enemies. But anyway, let's take a look at this. Twelve treasures, two rescues. Pink candy pop bud, that's always good for us. Let's take the recommendation, which is apparently strange because it's No, it's fine. I thought it wasn't giving us those those two. Because I thought it was tank zero, but no. 65 blue, some uh pinks, and some whites. Interesting combination of Pikmin. We're probably gonna get some more. As we go down. Can we get more than a hundred? Probably not. Because that's something else I've wondered about, because we can get more than a limit, technically. Can we get more than a limit inside of a dungeon? Like, now that we've reached a hundred. I don't know. Uh, anyway, we might actually be able to... I mean, it's probably not a great idea, but can we? No, we can't. It gets blocked by an invisible wall. That nearly just threw them off the edge. It's fine. I'm fine. Also, oh, this poison. I think that's poison. That is poison. That's really rude. Although we have white people on us, so I probably should just deal with that. But also, we can just dash through it, so. Let's get that dice. Die. I don't know. It's probably a bit risky to jump all around. <laughs> I should probably be more careful. Okay. Okay, that's good. So they're gonna definitely. It's definitely gonna try and take the other. Corpse. Or something. Almost worked. Almost. But not quite. There we go. Got it. And there's the pink candy pop bud. So let's break down this wall to get to that. 
also need to take that down so we can get that. Which if we have winged Pikmin, we can actually just make them do that probably. And not worry about it, I don't know. It doesn't really matter, they, they land up there, as long as it's targeting correctly. Okay, there we go. Let's get some more winged Pikmin. I wonder if we're going to get all the types of onions. There's, n there's never been an onion for the white Pikmin and all the purple Pikmin, so... It's going to be interesting to see what onions there are. Let's get those. Get these, I guess. I think these are pretty safe. That was a very bold move. Okay, that's all that. Pikmin is stuck again. I think we need... Oh, we need just any Pikmin. To build this. I thought we were going to need to w use Wing Pikmin. I mean, that's probably the fastest way to do that, so... So what is with this thing? A little bit concerning. But that's okay. Also, there's another thing over there that took the... die. Did it kill one Pikmin? Apparently not. But it definitely could have tried to. It might have been actually faster to just take whatever Pikmin. Oh well. Gonna regroup at the the base before we do the next few things. Because I need Ochi and stuff to take care of things. Probably. I'll get that back as well so that doesn't steal it. Oh, they're on it. That's why they're not dead. Could have ended, ended badly for us. It's really angry at me. We got it. Just gonna take it back anyway. Okay, let's try and get that thing. Which we can use our pink wing Pikmin for. Might be alright. Just like that. There we go. Lift off. <laughs> it's like watching it in slow motion fly towards the board. Kinda. <laughs> and to make a 45 degree turn. That too. I- you can't prove I'm cheating. Very nice. 20% so there's 5 floors. It's, I don't think there's been a single dungeon that I haven't understood how many floors there are, just by the progress on the first floor. Okay, another candy pop bud. There's also this thing here that we want to probably take out before it has a chance to do, even do anything. Don't want it tossing that Pikmin around. Ah, uh, there's a lot of bad stuff, kinda. Not terrible, just bad. It's gonna be problematic. Let's get that. Yellow track. Which I think we need winged Pikmin for because it can't travel up otherwise. Like that. Transcends boundaries that other Pikmin can't deal with. Gonna send you to do that as well. Need to be careful with this. Of you. I'll probably let the stuff get back. Just so I don't have to think about it too much. Pick one having trouble. Oh, they are. They're stuck here. Because they're not wings, Pikmin. Well, we'll stop them from doing, doing that then. Let's check what's up here. 
Which looks like it's actually the way to the next floor. So I don't exactly need to do this. I will check what's in this hole. We do need to, however, lower the gate before we can go down a level. Oh, hey, a bomb rock. Nice. I'll take that. For later. Oh, there's the switch. Nice. Well, let's press that then. Let's be very careful. Very careful, maybe. Almost. Oh, what are you doing to me? That's quite an attack. I don't think he's had that attack before. Okay, let's uh call the winged Pikmin over. Because we're probably gonna want him. Just for dealing with stuff. Also, switch Joy-Con. That's kind of amazing. I have to throw them up. Oh, but I'm plucking Pikmin now. Okay, that's fine. Getting some more winged Pikmin. Still need to be careful not to lose them. Okay. Now, how do we get down there safely? Over here. Okay. Let's pluck these. I think we can clear out the rest of this floor now. Just fine. Okay. That is actually everything on this floor cleared out, so we don't need to worry about that. Just need to make sure I remember to take these enemies. No, Pikmin. Need to take the Pikmin. They're not enemies. Also can flower a few things here. Get another material. Oh, that's it. Okay. Actually, let's go pluck these. Left them in the ground long enough for them to bud, so... That's probably good. Just have that. A little bit of extra speed. Okay, let's go. Also, the ultimate testing range thing hasn't come into play yet, but... We might be alright for a little bit longer, hopefully. We're halfway through. So... We'll have a rescue at this point, probably. Interesting. Must be a castaway, but there's also spiders. That's on the other side. You need to be very careful with those spiders. When this, when you have to figure out which side they're on. Thank you. Why can't I call them out of the bubbles? They should be able to be called out of the bubbles. They have been before, so... Ah, uh, that is also on the other side, so that's a double trap. Kinda. At least to me it's a double trap. There's also a bubble spewer there that we need to be careful of. Take our time. Also, if those bubbles go directly into the spider, I'm going to be mad. Most Pikmin really wanted to cause trouble. It's also probably not good to charge into these spiders, if I had to guess. I don't even want to test it out to find out if that's the case or not, because I don't want them to just go, like the winged Pikmin, to just go into the web and die. <laughs> that would be bad. And I think the rest of my Pikmin will also go directly into the web on the ground level. On the ground, floor, whatever, I don't know. Mm. 
No! He went over the edge. That's really rude. I don't know if that was my fault or if it just... I don't know. But that Pikmin's definitely gone now. Get some more Winged Pikmin. I should just be using Winged Pikmin a little bit more. Or something, I don't know. Okay. Guess I'm getting this first. I guess the good thing is they don't immediately go onto the ground, possibly. I don't know if they're immune to the... I don't know if they're immune to that, though. 